case study based learning is a powerful tool in your learning journey which will have a significant impact on your strategic thinking capability and your strategic decision making capability with cim we've been involved in over 15 years of case study based learning and the results have been phenomenal in our graduates now if you look at the history of case study based learning it might even go back to the 1900s of course was more popularized by some of the work done by some of the Ivy League universities like Harvard. And you would have also heard the term of problem-based learning, which has similarities to case study-based learning. Now, a case study could be a short, sharp uh, piece of information, or it could even be a mix of complex documents that has a, a wider degree of information about a business problem. Now, those short, sharp type of case studies you will find in your level four, which is your certificate level, in your applied marketing examination. A very interesting case studies, which gets you to think about business issues, marketing issues from a multiple angles. Whereas your global marketing decisions case study, the ultimate case study at level seven, would give you a, a complex context of a global company with multi-stakeholder issues for you to think through how to drive that company's profitability and its uh, growth. Either which way, big or small, a case study gets you to go deeper into hidden issues that possibly won't be visible uh, if you look at it from a singular dimension. So, Unraveling a case study is an exp exciting experience and uh, sometimes if you use the wrong tools and you go through a wrong process, you might find it more or less uh, becoming a bigger mess which might even strangle you and strangle the company uh, that you are trying to solve the problem itself. So the right tools, techniques and uh, right facilitation by a, someone who's got experience in case study based learning is going to be a, a very valuable advantage for you in that process. The skills that you build will predominantly be anchor on analytical capability and decision making capability. Your ability to identify a business problem sharply, finding solutions, your overall uh, ability to generate ideas. How do you organize these thoughts? How do you synthesize them? How do you build hypotheses? How do you identify patterns? All of these are CEO level, entrepreneurial level skill sets that a case study based learning will sharpen in you as a key component of your competency mix. So here's an example of a short case study that you would find in level four. Now, what happens in level four is the examiner will throw short case studies from multiple business contexts. This is a heritage beer brewery, family business that goes and uh, public quotes the company. So it changes the ownership structure and from a traditional uh, segment focus to own operated pubs, how the market moves into supermarkets where canned beer is sold for household consumption, all the way to gastro pubs. Very interesting. And in a very short time for you to read this through, analyze it and take some decisions is going to make you a sharper in real life. Similarly, if you look at on the same assessment, the examiner tested the students with a very uh, small scale gym which had a challenge of balancing a customer segment uh, decision of pensioners, older, versus a younger working class group of customers. So pretty interesting how the diversity of case studies can help your business strategy, marketing brain work uh, from multiple angles. All the way to uh, a gaming company, another case study that appeared in 2017, to a pharmaceutical company who has to deal with doctors and their 
challenging behaviors uh, in prescribing drugs all the way to pharmacies to hospitals that are government or to private sector and from over the counter to prescribe drugs it's a very complex industry if you look at the global marketing case study which is phenomenal in the content it provides you and the context it sets the last case study was on walmart the year before the marketing teams worked on hsbc all through pandemic times gillette uh, having challenges from men's grooming which has gone to a total different level with more casual dressing work from home etc and and these case studies which are global in nature complex in stakeholder gets a graduate to look at a world in spite of whether they are working in a small company or large company in real world or they are probably in a developing country or a developed market you get a global outlook to how business works and today that the pandemic that we are up against has taught us whoever you are you are global this prepares you to be able to face the realities of the world so as you could see 30 to 40 pages of information both qualitative and quantitative from different dimensions of that company competition market stakeholders will set up a perfect ceo challenge in the form of a case study so the brief will direct the graduates towards strategic thinking fundamentally looking at how do you drive growth and profitability of a company which is what it is when you run a business but then uh, underneath the iceberg of that performance are culture structure and the systems of the company and uh, all the way to figuring out resources competencies constraints and that makes you a uh, absolute strategic thinker so the analytical work that takes about a month in this case is converted into a strategic audit generally it takes uh, about 6 pages to do this and that type of work is exactly what you would do as a consultant and in real world you will have this skill set of doing a strategic audit before you subscribe to some ideas to grow the company or prescribe certain recommendations this is a good practice that's going to help you continue the work you do in real world and that analysis is used in taking some absolute strategic decisions to grow and improve profitability of a company in your case study so the preparatory work in that comes in your form of assignment that you're going to write a report uh, example in this case understanding some of the strategic uncertainties in the world right now in the markets you deal with which is relevant for every company uh, but students do need to take a deep view on understanding uncertainty versus ambiguity uh, because sometimes you are not really clear how to pin uncertainty to how it impacts your company if you look at a vuca analogy the volatility uncertainty uh, the complexity they are all different factors that makes business challenging but you have to really pin it in the right place the resources and competencies of a company is what gives its competitive advantage and to really ask those brutal questions requires a ceo to go and take a deep dig inside the organization and what's outside uh, your resources of the past might not be resources that can give you a competitive advantage today we've all heard about kodak uh, we've all heard about what happened with uh, nokia the challenges companies like nike faces today mcdonald you name it and then our new markets have got uh, emerging opportunities where companies like airbnb was uh, thriving on some of them and suddenly those markets disappear so the resources competency mix up very dynamic finally it leads to strategic options which is where your ceo capability has to come in to figure out what's suitable what's feasible and what's acceptable for your company and these are no easy options to finally select from the best uh, alternates available for you and uh, in this case obviously when you try to execute some of these options constraints hold you back sometimes your culture holds you back 
we almost know what option would be the ideal. But when you try to execute it, constraints hold you back sometimes as a country, as a company. So this is a, a great example of the power of case study based learning, which is an experience when you come to Daffodil, because this is our area of strength, because the facilitators involved bring in real life experience of business uh, as well as uh, case study based learning. And uh, finally, you take a complex problem and you analyze it from multi dimensions using your strategic capabilities and you need to build a couple of sound decisions which will define the destiny of the institution you are focused on. So we look forward to welcome you to a case study based problem solving approach towards learning.